finish tonight with the first double double of your career provided the team with eight dunks how does it feel to provide such a spark offensively uh you know the coaches you know they demand you know energy from me so you know coming out I was just trying to be aggressive and you know my, my teammate found me I was crushing the glass and you know takes up when do you know I mean you might be on the kind of track for a night you had was there a moment or just early on uh you mean when in the game did you kind of know you were you were on you were Oh, you know, it's just, you know, when you go in the game, you just got to play hard, play the energy, and, you know, let the chips fall away, whatever, you know. Chris, how hard is it when, you know, you, you hadn't scored in the last couple of games and didn't get a lot of minutes, but you're a veteran. You've been around this team a long time. <laughs> how how easy or difficult is it for you to stay engaged and then be ready when your number's called like it is tonight, even though you were doing things on the defense, but tonight you had the opportunities at the offense? <clears throat> I mean, you know, our team is really, you know, we have a really good team, and, you know, the coaches always preach, you know, the quality of our, 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 of our depth is like, you know, what's really keeping us, you know, going. So, you know, every, every, every night is going to be somebody different, you know. If it's not your turn, you know, you got to cheer for your brother. And when it's your time, you know, your brother going to cheer for you. So, you know, we just got, we just stay engaged. <clears throat> Everybody on this team really is, you know, very genuine, genuine people, and, you know, they're happy for you. So I'm happy for them when it's going for them. You know, they're happy for me when it's going for me. You had to be pretty happy, though, tonight, right? Yeah. <laughs> it seemed like the passing, I guess that's 21 assists, the passing to you, but really overall seemed to be really crisp. You feel like you guys are kind of getting into a really good rhythm offensively right now? Uh, you know, we're just trying to move the ball, you know, get everybody involved, our shooters, you know, you know, guys getting in the gym, so, you know, we got to, you know, you know, PJ, you know, MJ, you know, find them, you know, that's why we play inside out, trying to find those guys, and, you know, they're trying to find us, me and Fiandre inside on the labs or, like, on the post-ups. How good does it feel to see the guys that usually doesn't get in the game be able to play in the ACC game uh, down the stretch? Oh, the, especially the green team, you know, we, those guys really help us in practice, you know. <clears throat> they kept us, you know, get, get us ready for the games and stuff like that. So I was really happy for them. You know, everybody on the bench was really cheering for them, as you guys can see. You know, every time they score, we were just, you know, we really, we feel how, you know, we know how, like, how hard they play. Like, you know, they, they, they work in practice. So, you know, it kind of like, you know, it's really good to just see them out there playing. We saw the bench kind of rally to you at one point. We saw them celebrate for the green team. Just what's that speak to about just kind of the culture of this year's team? Uh, <clears throat> you know, everybody's just, you know, everybody's happy, you know, whenever it's going for you, you know, it's just like, you know, like I say, you know, the green team, you know, is part of our success, you know. So when we, you know, they haven't been able to get in the games lately. So, you know, when they get in, it's just like, you know, it's a really big deal. Chris, you guys usually play ranked top ACC opponents, Wake's kind of struggled. What does it say about the team that you were able to take care of them pretty easily? I mean, you know, ACC games, you know, you just got to come out and play because you never know. You know, every game in ACC is a dogfight. You know, you can't just let up because you're playing a, t a team that, you know, might not have the same record as the, the, the team that we played last week. So it's just we came out, you know, we play every opponent like, you know, like, you know, we like it's, 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 a, it's a dogfight every game. Did you enter this game um, expecting for the paint to, or attacking the paint to be such an emphasis of the offensive attack? Uh, I mean, the coaches talked about it, you know, them playing zone and stuff like that. You know, we got to, you know, you know, be able to, you know, post up and then, you know, the guards can find us, you know, all those set screens and run to the paint and stuff like that. So that was part of the, the game plan. You guys all set? Chris Dow, fill up. Thanks, Chris.